Hey everyone, this is Suja. Thank you for joining me today. Today I wanted to just uh, give myself a big pat on the back because I called it yesterday <laughs> and I was right or it kind of worked out the way I called it. So we had uh, this uh, red bar form today and by the looks of it, um, Bitcoin's below the 42.73. It's probably going to stay there for a while and then come back up. Um, I don't think there's going to be a systemic breakdown as long as Bitcoin does not close anything below 44,463. It'll probably just hit around 50,000 or maybe it'll probably come back a little downer here, but it'll probably come back way the hell up. So we're still in, say, good territories. We're okay. Nothing to worry about. Um, I probably should get into Bitcoin at this price range, but I'm going to wait for the third and final um, brick for the price break chart to pop and then I'm back in. All right, and then yeah, the Renko, not saying much. And the Kage, I showed you guys the Kage and how I use the Kage to get the 44,000. So it should be fine. All right, let's go check out Ethereum because Ethereum is bay, yo. Water is such a fun thing to drink as opposed to every other liquid. Okay, so this is Ethereum. Uh, yeah, not good, not good. This is probably a good time to buy. Um, Cause look, it's <laughs> it's below the green. And my green is, I think it's my 30 day moving average or EMA. Yeah, it's my 55 day EMA. So that's not really a good sign if it's below the 55. Um, Anytime it's below the yellow, which is my 21 day moving average, I kind of sit back and I'm like, okay, yeah, I need to reassess. And the angles I don't like. So, um, yeah, the price break chart has is putting out this big um, giant uh, break here. And uh, yeah, so one, two, three break almost breaks the fourth, the fourth one. Yeah, it probably comes down somewhere in the 1400 range. Uh, Jesus Christ. Um, I would not worry until it comes back down to 1300, but um, yeah, it doesn't look very good. So anything below 1379, I would, uh, I would be super cautious, um, not gonna lie. Uh, I am not a fan of anything below 1,379. Long-term wise, I mean, anytime it's crossing this area, you know, uh, not a very good uh, signal. You can actually buy here if you're really wanting to go back in. I think, I think this is almost done playing out, you know. It might actually be you know, it comes down roughly 14, breaks 14, 45, and then goes back up. So, you know, you might, you might want to, you know, set your, uh, um, by you, I mean me, not financial advice, not financial advisor. Sorry, the wording should be different. I might want to, you know, set my um, limit orders here at 14, 442. Again, anything below that, is when I'm like, okay, danger signal, leave, <laughs> sell, <laughs> short. And then we're gonna go back to the greatest charts of them all, the, the memest of them all, Dogecoin. Uh, let's see, Dogecoin. Doge charts, Doge's bay, yo. Yeah, like I said yesterday, um, we want, you know, 0.0458 to be the sort of the holding ground area. And we want it to sort of hit this and then come back up. If it breaks this area, mm, trouble is afoot, right? So, you know, and it's not looking good. I think it'll it'll probably come here uh, at some point, um, probably break through this one and then that'll be it and it'll probably rebound. Uh, and then, yeah, that's about it for my analysis. I'm calling these bed videos because Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Dogecoin spell bed. So this is bed two. 
Um, everybody who's in the market right now, these are my target areas where I could be buying. You know, my limit and sell orders would be around those numbers, right? For Dogecoin, I would be looking at, uh, what am I looking at? Sorry, hold on a second. You know, 0 0.0466 is where I want to buy and then bounce back up. Uh, yeah, and then for Bitcoin, geez, for Bitcoin, I'm looking at 50,000, 50,562. And then for Ethereum, where's my ETH? Uh, my Ethereum. I'm again looking at roughly 1,444 is where I'm going to buy. And then, you know, I'm by basically out. It, it, if that level, if that 1,379 is broken, I'm out. <laughs> I'm sorry. At that point, I'm out. Okay, so that's that. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one. Bye.